The blow that killed Orgrim permanently dented the backplate of this armor. It serves as a constant reminder that the enemy can strike where you least expect it. My story mirrors that of all orcs, a tale of savagery and redemption. You would make an adequate ghoul, mindless and proficient at repetitive tasks. As your proficiency with each hero increases, you will unlock their ultimate form, the very sight of which will strike fear into the heart of your foes. When my brother Derek was killed, my father swore an eternal oath to destroy all orcs on Azeroth. I always wonder how I would handle a loss like that. The demon slaughtered my village, burnt it to the ground, and left me for dead. I'm just looking to return the favor. A ghost's first and best weapon is her mind. Everything else is supplemental. To ask why we fight is to ask why you are playing Heroes of the Storm. It is for the experience. You know, for 10,000 years old, Taronda still looks pretty good. At least that's what they tell me. When the going gets tough, well, the tough call on the good old Hyperion and blast the hell out of everything. First, the Alliance has failed my people. Then, the Illidari. It does not matter. My people will be avenged. You can take the king out of the mountain, but you cannot take the mountain out of the king. I bear my master's name, as her master did before her. Someday, my apprentice will bear mine, and she will find an apprentice to bear it after her. They say odd objects attract gunfire, and that red team sure looks pretty odd to me. Long ago, an oracle of my people foresaw the arrival of a hero. One who will guide my blade to victory. Clearly, you are not that hero. Know this, demon. After this battle, I will destroy you. Once I intervened on behalf of humanity, saving your people from being erased from creation. I'm beginning to regret that decision.